Hi, this is John Sawash. Welcome to Google Forms for Educators. In this video, we're going to take a very brief look at creating and organizing Google Forms. To create a form, you need to start in Google Drive, which is where I am right now. We're going to click on New, then we're going to go down to More, and that's where we'll see Google Forms. Now, you have two options. If you click on the Google Form icon, you will create a new blank form. Alternately, you can also choose to create a form from a template. Google has created some nice templates that you can use. Uh, but right now, we're just going to create a blank form. So I'm going to go ahead and click that. And that'll build my blank empty form that I can uh, start working with. Now, the first thing I recommend that you do when you create a form is give it a name. We don't want uh, any untitled forms in our Google Drive account. It becomes very confusing. So we'll just uh, call it something um, biology quiz something like that, and we're ready to go. We can begin designing our form as we wish. Now your form is going to go into your Google Drive account. You'll see it right there, and it's going to just be in there like any other file, like a Google document or Google uh, presentation. So we can move it into different folders uh, if we need to. If you're ever uh, struggling to find a form that you've created, you can always go to the search bar up at the top of Drive, click on the arrow on the right side, and where it says type, we're going to limit this to forms. And if you want to go even further, you can say forms that are owned by me. And this will show all the forms in your Google Drive account organized by last modified. And hopefully you'll be able to find it from that list. So just a couple quick tips on creating and organizing your forms.